in the beginning it was. I was sitting there and there was times I was doubting myself, but eventually I started talking to Coach Hop and he told me I had to be I had to be stronger mentally and I let Coach Bayon get into my head and that's what I started doing and I used to wonder why I'm here and it got to the point where I realized that I'm the one on the court, I'm the one playing, he's not the one out there. So I just I just knew that I had to go out there and play my game and everything would be fine. What were the things that you doubted the most? Uh, I don't know, just my decision going there and, and if I even was good enough to play in college and stuff like that. So, I mean, it got to the point where, like I said, I just had to like put it all right behind me and, and just keep on working hard and just wait for my turn. And as years went by, it was getting better and better and better. And my, my time came last year. What changed? For you to get to the point where now you were playing consistent, what do you think was the change? Uh, my, my work, my work ethic I had last year going into the summer. Um, I mean, it was always a hard worker, but I came out here and worked out at Impact for a little bit. And I was playing against NBA players, working out with NBA players, and I mean, I'm doing good against them, holding my own against them. And, I figured I could do that against college players definitely this for this season. And, I mean, I just carried their confidence into this season and it definitely helped me a lot. How important is confidence for you? Oh, it's very important. I mean, if you don't have confidence, you're just going to be out there and you're going to be looking over your back and be scared and stuff like that. So, you, I mean, you can't go out there playing scared. You got to go out there and play your game and do what you do best. Don't try to go out there and do too much. What, what were people telling you, um, scouts were saying, uh, about, about your game? I mean, they were saying I can't shoot the ball, I'll definitely be a late second round, to not drafted. I mean, that just fueled me to get scored and gym and work harder and just get ready for the combine and just go out there and do what I have to do.